welcome to Music, Movies and More. Always a pleasure and privilege bringing the show to you and thank you so much for keeping the faith. I'm so glad that you're part of the show today. Remember that you can send us all your tweets and of course your messages and all the things you'd like to see on the show. On the address you see on your screen right now, we would love to hear from you. Well, thank you so much for being a part of the show today. Now today I got a guest as usual and we're going to have a fun time because he is a fun guy. So you get to meet my guest after the short break. It's music, movies and more. My name is Marin. Thanks for hanging there. Welcome back. It's still music, movies, and more. And I've got my guests in the house. Now, I was telling somebody that this, my guest, is so cool. You know, the suave gentleman. And, and then he just does like, no, nah, oh, no, no, no. This humility that you know is, a, you know, inside, inside, there's some funk. This guy was born cool. <laughs> you know, when you have a baby and a baby comes out crying, like wailing, yeah. with all their face looking like, you know, something beats them inside. This guy came out like, you know, hey, I'm in this world now. Hey, Joseph. It's great to have you on the show. All of that for me. All, I'm telling you, you are just one of those people. You're not loud, but you, you make people notice you. Because it took me a, a while. Mm. You know, I've been seeing you in movies, here and there in series. You should notice this guy. And then the funny thing is that you're playing major roles, but there's just something not loud. But there's, you just, it's in your head. Yeah. It's in your head. And I honestly have to confess, as a, um, I should be ashamed to say that the first time I, I saw you, I thought you were Ghanaian. You're not the only one. Okay, so I feel better now. In a lot of people, not just in Nigeria, even when I travel out of the country, I've had quite a few people ask if I was even Liberian, some of asked if I was Cameroonian. Uh -huh. I'm like, I said, no, I am Nigerian. Like, are you serious? So you don't sound like the average Nigerian. You don't, I don't know, something about you. I say, There's thank you something. very much. I'm like, yeah. Something. I know, it's just me, I'm Nigerian. You're Nigerian? Yes. <laughs> Where are you from? I'm from Kogi State. Are you serious? Yes. Okay, so this name, is it your, is it like? No, it, no, 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 it is my name. Benjamin is your father's? Yes. Really? Yes. Wow. My mom is from the East. Wow. Yes. You have evil blood in you. Very you much. You are kidding Very me. much so. That informs my business decisions. <laughs> <laughs> you know, because honestly, I, I have to say that you've just been there. And, you know, because I, I, I used to have a, a show similar to this one. I used to critique movies. Mm. And I, I, I would keep on going like, this guy. Th who is this guy? Who is this guy? Who is this guy? He's just there. He's just thing. there. But then you just know he's there. Yes, thing. Are, is this like, are you reserved or what what well what yeah, well, opinion well I, I think i think that image people see of me has a lot to do with my personality okay. i'm someone who's I, I like to keep to myself i'm quite uh, reserved i'm i'm not an introvert no yeah. but i just like my space mm. you know i don't like to be all up in people's faces okay. you know and I, if I want to be in your face, it should be for a good reason. For a good you know, reason. So there should be something given and stuff and all. So I, I like, you know, uh, for me, the regular day will just be me sitting up in my room and just watching television, watching movies, or just, yeah, that's me. I like staying indoors. Wow. I mean, that, the truth of is that it's really strange because you, you always play strong romantic leads. I mean, this guy has, <clears throat> I think, uh, yeah. Genevieve. Hello. Uh, like, hello. <laughs> Like once, you, once you've been Jennifer Nudges like romantic lead, like duh, it's that's done. It. That's it. It's done. That's it. So let's just pack up and go. Just it, you know. <laughs> but, but you still just you done it. And then you just yeah, of course, wow. for the love of the art. Wow, that's amazing. So I have to ask you because you do project film and you do it so well. You've done it for years. I oh, it's very rare. I'm not saying it's impossible, mm. but it's rare for somebody to be in one field, good in this field, and in another field, be good in that field. It's usually like, oh, he's such a good actor, he now thinks he can come to our own area and come and take business from us. But you do it seamlessly. Yeah. Was it something you always wanted to do, or you just came? Yeah, show business. Well, they're saying that, well, wait, let, let them wait on, until, what they, 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 that's still up there. <laughs> Okay, uh, just to bring a leaf from you as regards people who say, okay, you just want to come knock us off the stage and all. Yes. Hey, well, let them wait until I, until I unveil the musical part of me. No ah. way! Are you serious? <laughs> okay. So you sing too? Of course. We'll close shop at that point. <laughs> Look, excuse me, like what can you not do? Well, I don't know. I don't oh. know. It's, it's, it's God. It's, 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 it's God. It's, I don't know. It's, I, I enjoy what I do. Uh, it's obviously. it's it's effortless, you know. It, it you know it just it just I don't know. Uh, the inspiration and everything just comes from deep within. When I'm, you were a young boy, what did you think you'd do? When you honestly, grew up? yeah. Truth of matters, never had 
major aspirations like we usually had then. Like, yeah, okay, I, I want to be too, this. To be honest, no, I didn't I, know. I didn't know. I just said, okay, well, let's just move with the <laughs> let's just move with the wind. And hey, and next thing I find myself going for auditions here and there, and I'm like, okay, wait a minute. Seems I have a flair for this thing. Okay. Okay, why don't we just pursue it? And well, and one layer led to another and to another, and voila. This is what you're doing this now. This is what I'm doing. Because he I'm also compares. <laughs> That's what I'm saying that he's like taking bodily bread from our table. Hey, come on. We're going to draw a line. <laughs> Stay there. I'm come doing our cross. Of course, I'm here. Hey, the stage is big enough for everyone. <laughs> so now, your first audition, what was it like for you? Hmm. My for acting first, because you know you do so many things. For acting. For acting, my first audition was, um, hmm. It was tough. It was tough and um, because what I got there was, Hey, you you fit so perfectly. You are you are you are the perfect candidate for this role. I mean, you you're good for it, but um, it's just that you look a bit too. You don't look the part, sort of. Really? Like, um, but you know every other thing, but you just don't look the part. But that didn't deter me. You know. Oh, you know. That's good. I kept pushing. I kept pushing, and trust me, when you go for auditions, and you know you're 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 just one single one one quiet voice, one tiny voice in the midst of a multitude. Mm. Like, what I'm talking about, I mean, I mean multitude, I mean as much as 2,000, 3,000 people, wow. you know? And at the end of the day, maybe they might just be auditioning for three, four roles. Oh my you goodness, know? that's of crazy. Of course, everyone wants, wants a gig, yeah. you know? And it, 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 was, it was quite tasking for me. It was quite tasking. You didn't give up? No, I didn't give up. No, 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 no. The can-do spirit, you know, had been embedded in me from the get-go. So wow. I just felt like, hey, come on. If it's doable, then I can do it. Then you can do it. You know? It's so amazing if it's doable. Then I can. <laughs> How did you scoop Project Fame? Because that's like, hmm. for years now, you have, you know when somebody hmm. says they have dug a um, balance there? <laughs> the ballet of Project Fame, you are, as in, hmm. you are now the ballet of Project Fame. How well, did that happen for you? Project Fame was, it was, I feel it was for me, because I'm someone who's governed by principles, okay. you know, and everything around me is, I tend to permit me though, but mm -hmm. I always cling on to uh, spiritual foundation. Yeah. You know, I just felt it was destiny for me. Wow. Because I remember when I came for the first audition, I auditioned with, I, I, there were a lot of people. Yeah. And when I mean a lot of people, a lot of big wigs in the mm -hmm. industry, a lot of big wigs. I don't want to mention names, mm -hmm. a lot of big wigs. And I auditioned, and as a matter of fact, the first person I auditioned with, was it then? Yeah, I think, yeah. Was the first person I auditioned with, was she, was she Adora? Was she the first female I auditioned with? I can't remember, you know, but I auditioned and I felt good about it, you know, and I asked them, I got good feedback, yeah. and I waited on it, and at the end of the day, it didn't come my way. That was the first. That's that the was first the, the, the first season, okay. and I heard it was Dari, mm. and I said, "Okay, fine, it makes perfect sense." Saints. Dari is a product of Project, Project Fame South Fame Africa. Himself, yeah. yeah, so hey, it's, it's good fine. if you're bringing it here. Mm. No, it's okay. Mm. I went to sleep, mm. you know. And then this following year, which is the second season, that's I was talking about destiny. I just put a call through to Mr. Ayeni. I said, mm. "Sir, I'm just calling to say hi. I don't know why. I'm just calling to say, oh, Joseph, perfect timing." We're shopping for a new host. I'm like, whoa, you're real, really for real? So yes, please come in and audition. I'm like, okay. Hey. I came into audition, and of course, again, alongside a, a lot, lot of big wigs. Yeah. And it went through. It went good. We had a series of auditions. Had a few callbacks and all, and waited again. Mm -hmm. Then the final audition, the final step was this. It was quite tricky. <laughs> so I, he told me coming on a Saturday, mm. and that day they were recording Who Wants to Be a Millionaire. Yeah. I came in and he said, Joseph, you're going to host Who Wants to Be a Millionaire today. I'm like, excuse me. Sorry, <laughs> like, uh, so, sorry, yeah. sorry, so did you? Uh, but what did you say? <laughs> so you're going to host. Who wants to be a millionaire? And there I was clad in my t-shirt and jeans. Oh my god! And you know at that point where you are and everything you know about a show just suddenly disappears. Disappears. You have no like you never no, watched it before. I just, like, never watch it. I'm like, sir, I am honestly, I don't know what to say, but at this point, they say, Joseph, are you okay? I, I said, of course I am. <laughs> I say, yeah, but sir, I, I'm not appropriately dressed. He says, okay, we have a jacket somewhere around. We'll oh give my. you. I'm like, this guy is serious. Oh <laughs> and I thought he was still joking. Not until they brought me into the studio. 
and then the, the, open, the music for the opening sequence mm. played, and I said, these guys are serious. serious. And he says, yeah, and, and when it was done, I had to walk in, and I said, and there was, I, I opened up the show, and in front of a studio audience, wow. I'm like, okay, this is getting real. Mm -hmm. And after that, then, okay, I went through the fastest finger first yeah. process, and I got a winner. Okay. And then it was up until, the not until we, we were, it was time for us to play the game that I knew this was my final audition. Because when it was time to play the game, I, I, I realized that the, the, the chairs were not in position. Okay. There are no chairs there. There are no chairs. So when I brought the guy into the middle, and then the director says, caught. caught. I'm, then I say, uh, okay, what's next? Then he walks up to me. That's Mr. Ayeni. Oh. And says, congratulations, Joseph. You just passed your final audition. I'm like, what? you don't say. Are you for real? You don't say. Say yes, that was your final audition. Oh I'm like, for real? Man, that is an amazing story. Are you kidding me? I, I, so I said to myself, so, so what if I didn't know anything about the show? You know, you had never watched it before. So I, would have been, I would have been done for. I'm <laughs> like, like, take your bags and go. You know? You well, just told amazing. me. amazing. Yeah, he said, come on Monday. This was on a Saturday. He said, come on Monday for your contract. You just, oh, I'm like. Oh, Lord. I'm sure that weekend you were just you're kidding like, me? I'm like, OK. Oh, awesome, awesome. I, I was like, guys, did you, did you see me? I, I just presented <laughs> you know, I, 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 I just did that. Hey, hey, hey. Was me, was me. Keep that tape. Well, that's amazing. Yeah, it is amazing. Yeah, that's how I got on That's how it is. And for the last. Yes, yeah. not, because a couple with yeah, Joseph course, for the last years. Yes, He's ensured that nobody else gets to audition <laughs> for that role. He's ensured it. But it's fantastic. The continuity has been nice. Yes. Your movie roles, what's been the most tasking? What's been the one that got you like, whoa? And I, I know you get into character a lot, mm. you know, from shaving the head, growing a beard. You just, you just go all the way method acting so what has been the most challenging for you most challenging i would say was um a character i played in a movie called stripped okay um the guy was an athlete that got involved in an accident and it's confined him to a wheelchair oh okay so like the most part of the movie i was in a wheelchair and you know that has to be believable yes i mean extremely believable and there was a, there was a point in the movie where i fell off the wheelchair and when I even tried to walk, so all of that had to be believable. Believe it. Ah, it took a lot. A whole lot. That was the most tasking. Even so trying to. Are you kidding me? You know that, that wheelchair thing? It's oh, not easy to Are you to kidding me? Manipulate. Not until I got in the wheelchair yeah, and yeah, I understood. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Ah. And then I remember there was this particular scene where I fell off the wheelchair and I had to crawl. I had to crawl like someone who was crippled. Wow. Yes. This guy is, is a hard-working young man. He's a hard-working young man. And now, Joseph is, is quite vocal on BB. Uh, he tweets, uh, you know, and he just makes his opinion. You know, there's, there's people that just tweet like every day. But once in a while, he just tweets or has this BB message and he tells you a bit about the person he is. So we, we got some of this, some of these messages and would like you to like, just explain what was going in your head or what the situation was. Uh, when that happened and how it happened. I might be put on the spot oh, no, here. No, 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 it's just, just to get to know you a bit more through your own eyes, because sometimes we want, we want the question to come from you. So when you tweet something Miriam. or you send a BB message and we say it's from you, then you can explain to us. So if, if we can get one of the, you know, we won't take too much, maybe two or three. So. Uh, oh, no. come on now, there was this one. one, this was very interesting. He said, this, this was when uh, you were in London and you lodged at the Crown Plaza Hotel, Hydro, and all, an all too familiar experience of electricity supply was interrupted for about two hours. Oh, yes. And you know, you, you, the way you explain this, like, ah! And, I went, and then the, the beauty that you, you said when, when the light came on, uh, yeah, yeah. you said, you should have seen the shock on my face when it happened. For a second, I forgot that oh, I was in London. And then, the part I liked was when you said, when the night came, you said, open oh, Nepal. <laughs> <laughs> so tell me about this experience. You know, it was, it was, I don't, it, it, I don't, it was surprising for me. You know, this has never happened to me. Hey, excuse me, hey. Of all the times I've traveled, I'm like, hey, like, seriously? Parkour in London? In London. Hello. Someone messing with me here. I'm like, what's happening? You know, and that was, you know, I, I was in my room. I then looked out of the corridor. I actually took some pictures. You wow. know, they had shut the corridor and stuff. You know, they're like, you know, they, for security reasons, mm. everyone had to stay in. And it was still a bit shocking to me because I, I was actually in the bathroom okay. when, 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 you know, when they had a park out. And for some reason, I thought, okay, mate, wait, what's happening what here? Something sneaky. Mm. And, for two hours, it went on for two hours. Two hours. And I said, ah, you know, and, and the Nigerian man in me kicked in. Okay, let me tell you what happened. 
I was saying to myself, I said, ah, oh, why? Why should I be in the bathroom when they had a power cut? I should have been in the elevator. You know, so I could have sued them. <laughs> I've made some money. This is evil blood. Yes. So I said, I said evil evil blood. Blood. no, Joseph, why would you be in the bathroom at this point? No, you should have been in the elevator. You should have been in there. Well, that's an experience I have never heard. Are you it. kidding me? You were the, when I read that, I was like, really? In London, I have never heard any. I've never. Two hours. Two hours. That's amazing. That was an experience. Okay, now there's another one. Um, okay, now this one says a lot was misconstrued, and I will not hold anyone responsible for it because everyone is entitled to, to their opinion. And for me, I believe that when you embark on the journey like this, like that, it is something that requires the two people involved to have a certain oh, form of on. understanding. Ah, nah, so nah, nah. we're using this to bring. He says, "Let me go a bit spiritual." That's why he says spiritual. I said yes because. It's always in your tweets. Let me go a bit spiritual with you here. The Bible says, can two walk together if they do not agree? So there should be some form of agreement. This is one topic that's gone up, down, left, right, and down. One, people never know, just in case, people never know that you're married or we're married. So for all of you ladies, <clears throat> when it was tangoing with Genevieve, you were thinking you would be Genevieve. Well, he's tangled before. But what is it now? Are you, are you like totally available? Are you together? What's... Okay. Look, let me tell you, or, or on behalf of a lot of females, <laughs> I gotta ask this question. Um, mm. Joseph is on the purple. I have I've said I will. Are you single? I will. I've said I will not speak about this issue anymore. Are you single? Uh, oh, come on, Mary. Well, are yes. you single? First of all, are you single? Yes. Yes, you're single. Ah. Uh, so that's oh, a yes. Is, oh, come on. This is not fair. This is a yes. This, I, I you always say my, 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 this issue, this particular yeah. part of me should not come that's up That's why we use your, your quote. So it's, are you it's single? Unfair. First of all. No, you guys should not no, bring this up Okay, let, let's just break it down. We're not even going to go far. Are you single? Yeah. yeah. You're single. Are you going to get married again? Ah, uh, come on, man. Yes this or no? Yes fair. or no? Because you know what the problem is? The problem I have with these issues is this. Why I've decided to make sure I keep, I, you know, I, I, I shelve it as it is. Mm. Because a lot of times I've spoken... I've mis I've misconstrued a lot, you know, uh -huh, and I said to my and I said no, I will not talk about this issue anymore. Whenever it's brought up, I will push it aside. I, the other way. I, I push it aside. I do not want to. I just feel like that particular part of me should just stay private and it should just be me. It should be respected. And as a glutton for punishment, I will just ask one last question. You know, all through this interview, you've been suave and cool. So I'm going to I'm going to let you slide by just helping you interpret one word, okay. he's single. And he's going to leave it at that. <laughs> I don't know if he's ready to mingle, but let's, just, let's, let's take what we got, which is that single. And that's it. That's, I mean, we, we, we pulled that, I mean, I added my own to bring out that, that one statement. So, uh, Marian, Marian, Marian. Okay, one more thing that you Marianne, said. This I one, will get you. <laughs> you know, that's why I love my job. You know, when your friends, somebody outside, they'll be talking, talking, talking. When you get them here, you can, you know, and squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. All those, uh, you know, I like it. This sweat is coming out. Okay, <laughs> one last quote from Joseph. So, um, this one says, this one I found really amazing. It says, Happy New Year, folks. Glad we had all, we all had a seamless crossover into the new year. It is a new year. Things take a turn for the better. Change is constant. We should all desire to grow and achieve as much as God desires for us. That's the nice part. Please permit me to share this general announcement. <laughs> Please don't ask me to do things pro bono for you or your organization, magazine, newspaper, etc. Unless you fancy being let down personally. I have serious bills to pay, just like the rest of y'all. So if you want to hire my services, we can talk. But otherwise, don't even think about approaching me unless you pay for it. I repeat, over! <coughs> the time for me to pump up my resume with the fleeting thrill of being a good Samaritan is over. Unless you pay for it, I repeat. <laughs> This one is like, you know when somebody has sat down and thought about the future? <laughs> because this hey. came from inside. Hey. Joseph, what's going on? We all have bills to pay. <laughs> we all have bills to pay. So, hey, so if I keep doing this... No, no freebies. Hey, hey. <laughs> if I keep doing pro bono, how do I pay my bills? That's the thing. Mm. And I come, should I come knocking on your door? Like, <laughs> uh, please, I, hey, please. But this was a serious text. No, no, of course, seen. of course. It went viral. I was not even in the country when I sent this over. Wow. And people just kept calling me like, hey, dude, if this thing has gone viral. It's, hey, every station is playing it. Like, oh, look at it. It's gone viral, Joseph. I'm like, hey, 
But the thing is, I spoke the mind of a lot of people. Yeah. Yeah, that, that's the thing. Yes, I know. I hey, agree. I went into some people's um, 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 bad, bad books. books and all. It, it's, it's necessary okay. sometimes. It is very necessary. Sometimes you just have to say, state these things. You know, mm. of course, come on. We're all human beings. You all have s staff you pay. I have bills to pay mm -hmm. as well, just like you too. So come on, let's let's uh, let the will. Let, let's let's oil the will a bit. Let's oil the will a bit. Come this on. is done with pro bono. The company is shot on pro bono. <laughs> yeah, it's we're not, shot on pro it's, bono. It's not about the bills, hey, eh? Hey, hey, it's not about the bills. That's the thing you guys don't understand. It, it's it, the thing is, if, if I charge ten naira for my services, and you come to me and say, Joseph, I have two naira or three naira for this, would you do it for me, please, Joseph? Because mm. we have a tight budget here. It's left for me to say, okay, okay fine, fine, I could consider. So, no, I suppose you come in and say, um, Joseph, can you do this thing for us, please? Um, there's no budget. There's no money. Like, excuse me. Uh. Like, then close shop. Yeah. Why don't you close shop if you come I to? I really me? feel you in that one. Of so so I just not bold enough to send it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're gonna take a short break now. When we come back, Joseph is going to play a game with us. Now Joseph is an amazing actor, and we're gonna put that to the test. He's going to show us how he can interpret a role. <laughs> it's gonna be on the hot seat. Let's see if he passes this audition once again. Let's take a short break. We'll be right back. Welcome back to Still Music, Movies and More. Of course, this is like the fun part of the show. It, it wouldn't be movies, music and more without a game. Without a game, having fun with our guests. So, now Joseph, we know that you can act. We know your, your gifts are plenty. But today, we shall, we shall touch a bit on your acting ability because you've played different roles, okay? So, I can't see what's behind me. There's a screen behind me and there'll be some words or phrases. And all you need to do is act out that phrase so I can guess exactly what that phrase is. Hmm. Because, because you're so talented, we know. Hmm. For everyone you Let miss. Let me not fall our hand here. See? <laughs> <laughs> Joe? <laughs> hey. Joe, according to my people. Let me Bros not fall Jay. our hand here. Bros <laughs> Bros Cause the way I'm seeing this scene right now. <laughs> you better make sure hey. to get it. For everyone you fail, you owe me 10,000 Naira. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so I have said, let me not follow our hand here. <laughs> so if my producer and director is ready, can you uh, show him the very first uh, I can one? see it. Okay, so. Hmm. Mm. Happy? Happy? Cheering, cheering, che cheering, happy, cheering. Uh, cheerleading, che cheerleader. Ah! <laughs> okay, okay. Well, ten thousand lost. I didn't make that money. Next one. Yeah. Chopping. Mixing. Cooking. <laughs> Chopping, mixing, cooking, cooking, cooking. Ah! <laughs> okay, we're on a roll now. <laughs> Let's see what next. <clears throat> Make up! <laughs> Make up! <laughs> You're so silly. That's <laughs> my <make> up. <laughs> okay, what else? <sighs> Meditation, Medi meditating, Buddha, <laughs> Hindu, monk, uh, meditating, Buddha. What? <laughs> okay, um, center of my. Hmm, that's yoga. A yoga instructor, I should have thought about that. That's yoga. Okay. I was thinking Buddha. <laughs> okay. All right, let's let's try these two or three more. Let's see how far you go. Ah! I've not made any money from you. Nope. <clears throat> hmm. Picture? Posing? Model? Modeling, okay, okay. <laughs> well, you did that for a while. Yes, I did. Yes, you did. This guy's done everything, like literally. Okay, the last one. He's done everything. He's done everything. Oh. 
Fear, fear, fear. Um, scared, driving. What do you do? You're afraid, you're driving, you're on a ride in the park, riding park. Roller coaster! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> You did so well. Thank you. So I'm not like very great at that game. So I thought I was just going to make money from just. He's made so much money. I could have taken something from him. And he put one more. Okay, you want to try the last one? Okay. That's snooker. Pool. <laughs> Oh, Joseph, I love having you on my show. You're Thank just like you. the best. And you know what? You are, I have to say, it's not like psych, but you're talented. You, you're singing, you're acting, you're presenting, you're modeling, you're comparing. All the works. And then you have a great fashion sense. Did I say that? Thank he you. has an amazing fashion sense. Your Thank pictures you. are always there. And then you must exercise, because that figure is... Yes, I do. You do? Because come on. A lot. <laughs> oh, that's good. But you look good. Thank you. It was fun talking. To, I, I like totally enjoy talking to you. I felt like I was just sitting with a hey, friend. Hey, hey. We're buddies. I'm yeah, telling we're you, we got this connection. You know what I'm saying? She's oh, my buddy. I really, I love this guy. Like literally, really love this hey, guy. Ladies, the don't talent hate, don't is amazing. Hate, don't, hate, don't, hate, don't hate, don't hate, don't hate. But you know what I'm saying? While he's here, he belongs to me. Like, oh, once the show is over, <laughs> I give him back. But for now. <laughs> Well, thank you so much for being a part of the show, Joseph. I can't wait to have you back. Of course, I'm available. I, I want know to come back. When you, re you release the album, hmm, that day I will take tights and offer it. I'm not even joking about I'm not even going to try to speak this English. My Bini character will come we, out. We will come out. You will Bini, you will Bini, somebody will come out. My will come out. Oh, boy. Oh forget it, forget <laughs> that day. All this English will end. You will just shit We count the money in we public. We count it. 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 <laughs> <laughs> it's the music movies. Thank you for keeping the faith. We'll be back at the same time next week. And we want you to send your comments. Tweet at us. Send us a, a like on Facebook. Let us know what you enjoy about the show, what you'd like to see on the show, who you'd like to see on the show. So it's not about me just bringing on my favorite people. I won't be selfish like that. So let me know who you'd like to see or what you'd like us to talk about on the show. But I want to say thank you so much for being a part of the show. Till I see you next week, keep your head high. Bye-bye. <laughs>